Hello guys, today we're going to uh, reviewing that I got some Denver and Rio Grande Western steam locomotives and we going to because I made them first we have the Denver and Rio Grande Western K36 class so the Denver and Rio Grande Western K36 class was built in 1925 by Baldwin Locomotives work this locomotive was actually it had nine survived and one got scrapped. That was 455. The surviving on this day, which is 480, 481, 482, and 486, were owned by Durango and Silberton. 483, 484, 487, 488, and 489 were owned by the Coombers and Toltec. 483 was at storage. And I got tender here. Let's see, where is the tender? I guess I'm going to use um, the older version. This is an update version. Alright, web. Okay, the ad just pops out. Like, for no reason. And like, how? Oh, why it got th like that and here's how it works whoa it's going no wait it escaped let's use melon to stop let's use the melon to stop no it caused lag guys so we're going to do it so I'm going to join back This time I'm going to use this map. Okay, now let's go there and use... Um, let's get the K37 class. I use this for the update. What's the K37 class? It is, looks like a K36 class, but it's different. Since because I there's a bigger firebox thing, thing, but this one is flat and the tender oh, is made of from brick, I think. What I'm going to do, I use this this time. Oh, wait, 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 stop! We got some coaches too. Like I got um Okay, where is it? Okay, I don't know where's my the empty flat Ah there we go. Let's use an empty flatbed car. Three of those. After that trying to find a livestock or a box car. After that, I think we will use a non-empty one. Okay, now let's do it. Okay, we're going to pull this car. Okay, we're ready. Be but before we're ready, we had to turn on those. Okay. Never mind.
Okay, next up we have the K36 update version 2. I guess this one is without tender, so I'm not going to use it. And here is the K28. I updated also. And it comes with a tender. And here it is. Only three of them survived. That is 473, 476, and 478. And ready to go. Bang, 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 bang. Okay, just kidding, lol. Bang, bang. Going to crash. So we do have an express train. But we use a... C18, yep, we do have, this is with rod. Our old one is broken. And our other one just fall. So we update our C18. And this time, we gonna use it with rods. Alright then, where is the... Uh, roads area. Okay, now let's start the engine. Uh, okay. Oh, look! The rods is moving! The rods are moving! The rods are moving! Wow! It is moving! Look at that! Wow! It is moving! It is moving! Oh! It is moving! It is like in the a show. Oh no, it's not at the show. It's at the real life a basic. Wow! Wow! And it crashed. Now let's reviewing all the cars. We have flatbed, coach. And then what's next? Um, oh, I know. Not again. We have a livestock car, or even you can call it a box car. And even an empty flatbed for bigger engines like Grand Trunk Western 5629. Sorry, that's not even near reach. That's from Grand Trunk Western Railway. And it's number. And it's not a real Grand Engine. Okay. Oh my goodness. Whoa, look at that. That's funny. Okay, we have Big Jaw Apple. And he's going to kill. And he's going to eat the flood bed. Oh! And he died, yay. And water corns save the day. Since because he puts out water, cleaning all stuff. Oh my goodness. And okay, that's all. And that's all, guys. So goodbye.